Lucas, when did we end up? Determining point of temporal translocation. 2017? No, look, we need to get back. We need to get back to the council and let them know what's happening. How long before we can temporal translocate again? Translocation device, not charging. Crap, they must have fried it when they shot at us. Hang on. Are we where I think we are? Lucas, why of all places did you send us back here? The translocator had sustained damage. There was not enough power to return you to the future. I also calculated this location and point in time to have the highest chance of your survival. Lucas, you're a genius. Let's go. If you're looking for Cecil, he's out on a job today. Probably won't be back till tomorrow. Oh, that's okay. Dang. Looks like your electronic control module is broken. I'm waiting for another old one to come in. But that could take months. Well, if you bypass the affected circuits, you could probably get your bike going again. Thanks. Hey. Why don't you leave your phone number and I'll get my dad to call you if he comes back earlier. Oh no, it's okay. I don't think he'd be able to help me out anyway. Yeah? What's bust you? Um, my watch. Well, he isn't a watch repairman, but I'm sure he could give it a go. I don't want to trouble him. I'm actually in a bit of a hurry. Actually, do you think your dad would mind if I used his tools to fix my watch? Only if I supervised. Deal. So where are you from? Because you don't look like you're from around here. Can you keep a secret? Yeah, I guess I can. You really want to know? Yes. You're not going to believe me. Just tell me already. My name is Alec, and I'm a time agent from the future. I'm actually 157 years old. I'm employed by the government to go back in time and to fix any events that haven't gone the way that they were supposed to. Right now, I'm most likely being hunted down by a group of illegal time-traveling terrorists. And that's why I've come back to this timeline to fix my device and get back home. You were right. I don't believe you. What the heck is that? It's my scanner. Oh, damn. Lucas, run a diagnostic on all components. Diagnostics underway, Alec. Who was that? That's Lucas, my AI. He's integrated into my scanner and my watch. You ain't kidding about that time cop stuff, were you? Time agent. Yep, it's all true. So you're from the future? Yep. You said you were... 150 something? How is that possible? Well, in the future we have this treatment that can restore and rejuvenate DNA to that of a young person. It's pretty complex and expensive to produce. And this file here contains millions and millions of picobots which restore the degrading DNA. So, why have an old person running around time travelling and stuff? They wanted to hire people that were born in the 21st century because they'd lived during that time. I was hired when I was 97. So you've been doing this for 60 years? Yeah, well, after a few years of training, yeah. So why are you here? What's so special about 2017? Are you here to assassinate the president or something? Oh, I wish, kid. Look, my time travel device was fried when they shot at me. And the time travelling terrorists? What's the deal with them? I was selected for the mission due to my familiarity with the period they were hiding in, the 2030s. My assignment was simple bring back the vial at any cost. The group that saw it were going to use it somehow in a bigger plot to gain power. They were planning to reverse engineer the procedure to give themselves immortality. I'd been tracking this group for weeks and I'd finally discovered their base of operations. 
I took an opportunity to grab the vial, but they called me just as I was about to leave. Kill him! They had me pinned down with gunfire, so I had to do a risky temple jump out of there. So that's how I ended up here. That's pretty much it. Are they still after you? Most likely. They did look pretty mad when I stole their ticket to immortality. That's why I need to fix this. I need to get back to the Temple Affairs Council before they end up finding me and... Killing you. Yeah. I'm pretty handy with a screwdriver. I can see that. Um, but you do not know the first thing about how this stuff works. Try me. Okay. The primary generator feeds Polaroid's tachyons into the field coils here and here, which then generates a modulated quantum slipstream, which then pulls the operator from a point in space-time to a calculated re-entry point, which is why the capacitor here feeds off the cosmic microwave background energy of the universe and basically functions like a big battery. I understood capacitor and battery. You have a point. This technology is from 150 years in the future. So what does this do? Well, do you have his temporal coordinates? Kind of. His translocator device was damaged and it's making him hard to track. <sighs> you half wits. You need to get his exact coordinates. I don't want to give him any breathing room. So what's the deal with those guys anyway? Why would you want immortality? Yeah, I don't know. I was just tasked with retrieving this file. It was imperative that they didn't work out the formula. So time travelling is illegal? Yes. Actually, it was a team of university students that first cracked it. The plans got leaked online, and every black market scoundrel was building time devices out of any junk they could find and selling it to anyone that wanted it. That's when the Temporal Affairs Council stepped in. They made it illegal for anyone to use or possess a time travel device, and then sent agents like me back in time to fix events and retrieve people from time periods they weren't supposed to be in. And then a few weeks ago, a group called the Phantoms hijacked a medical transport and stole a bowl of picker bots. You can get back and fix things, right? That's the plan, and not get killed. We just need to fix this and then we'll be okay. Still a bit more work to do. Can you hand me that? Sure. Target confirmed and locked. Well, what are you waiting for then? Alex, you're in detecting three time incursions. They do not match any known quantum signatures used by the council. Crap, they found me. We've only got a few more minutes. What are we going to do? Lucas, how long before we can translocate? Calculating. Estimated time until charged. Nine, 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 nine years. Must still be an issue with the capacitor. If we could manually charge it, we'll hook it up to a heavy duty. Are you okay? What's wrong? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Detecting large volume cell lysis. Report to a medical facility for treatment immediately. You are overdue for gene restoration procedure. Well, have you got anything? It'll take some time to track him. The EM interference in this time is making it difficult. Hurry up, or I'll make you wish you were never born. Ah! All right. Go and plug that into the back of the generator and turn it on. Manual charging engaged. Power feed accepted. We did it. It's charging. Estimated charge time, three days, seven hours. It's okay, kid. At least we tried. Alec, I'm detecting futuristic technology in your proximity. Okay, we don't have much time. Look, take this. Oh. I'm in no condition to fight like this. You're just gonna have to... I'm just a kid. I don't have any of your time-travelling agent training or anything. Hey, look, it's okay. 
You can do this, I trust you. Don't worry, you're not gonna kill anyone. I've set it to stun. It's gonna fire an electrolyzed plasma bullet that knocks people out for a few hours. Alec, they are very close. Okay, you'll do great. Now get behind there and wait for my signal, okay? trying to charge your translocator. I don't think I'd have to chase you far, but this, this is pathetic. <coughs> I don't look too well. <coughs> um, do you know how many slugs like you I've killed? You're going to be number four. I don't think you're going to make your next gene restoration appointment. How does it feel? All those tiny cells crying out in agony while they explode like little popcorn. I really don't know why they keep old dogs like you around anymore. It's such a waste keeping you alive. When there are far more deserving people who could use your treatment. Oh, shh. I'll end your suffering soon enough. Just give me the vial. Give it to me. Did we just? Should be out for a good five hours now. Surrender, scum. Wait, can't we use their t time traveling device? The battery's probably fine, right? Even if I can get it to work, I wouldn't trust it to get me back. I'm just gonna have to wait for mine to charge. It might not take as long as Lucas estimated. Actually, we could use their power supply. We could salvage their capacitor, and we could bypass ours. <laughs> Kid, you're a genius. Auxiliary power input mode, device charging, calculating. 
estimated time until translocation is ready. Four minutes. Good job, kid. Time to head off to you, well done. You'll be able to get home now, and you can tell who's ever in charge about those guys and their plans. Yes, the council. I'm going to send a retrieval team back to pick them up whilst they're still unconscious. They won't be breathing fresh air for a long time. I want to give you this. Something to remember me by. Or I won't forget you. I don't think I'll be forgetting anything about today anytime soon. I've had that since I was your age. I know you'll look after it. What is it? Is it a quantum time leaper? Or a laser watch? Uh, no, it's just an old pocket watch. It's what inspired me to become a time agent all those years ago. Thank you, Alec. Strange thing about that watch, though, I never knew how it came into my possession until today. What do you mean? You'll figure it out. Diagnostics complete. Device at capacity. Look after yourself, Alex. I never told you my name. Look, I'm really sorry about this, but it's protocol. What's protocol? Twelve hour memory wipe should work, Lucas. Confirmed.